Hey folks, when last I left off, um, I kicked Ornstein and Smog's ass finally. Um, as you can see, I've got 16,000 souls, which was a little more than the last time you saw me. Still got my three humanities. Um, I figured before I grind a little bit, which is what you've all been telling me to do, because I guess my gear sucks, um, probably going to level up my... Hello, Mr. Knight, that's going to walk over here pretty soon. I figure I'm going to level up the Black Knight armor, because... You know, you guys keep telling me it's pretty good, so... Before I do that, though, I'm gonna go to Ornstein Smog's chamber, and, uh... Go around these guys. <laughs> I'm gonna go to Ornstein Smog's chamber, because apparently I missed something, um... Just past it. So... Right up here... What'd that say? Be wary of... Bean pole? That doesn't even make any sense! What's a bean pole? Whatever. So, anyway... Um, let's see here. Oh, hey, there is something over here. Um, oh, it's an elevator. Okay. Elevator going up then. Let's see here. Uh, oh! Wow, there's a bonfire right past their chamber. Jeez. Alright then. So, um, I'm gonna put a put a halt to leveling for now and just grind out, you know, souls for weapon upgrades and smithing and whatnot, and uh, we'll go from there. Where does that go? If I, if anything else happens that's pretty funny or whatever, I'll throw it in, but otherwise, with the next time you see me, I'll be in upgraded Black, Black Knight armor. So I'll see you guys then. Man, do I really want to go in here? Um. Oh, I like the music. Wait, is is she moving? Who is that? I don't know if I want to. Um. Sure. Just walk up to you and kneel. Really? Since the day Father is wounded and obscured, I have awaited thee. I bequeath the Lord Vessel to thee. Yeah, I still don't know what that is, but I'll take it. By the power of the Lord Vessel, you may now warp between bonfires? Are you serious? And beseech thee. Succeed, Lord Lord, and inherit the fire of our world. Thou shalt end in this eternal twilight and avert. Dude, if that item does what I think it does, Guinevere is freaking kick ass. Like, does this mean I can warp between any bonfire now? Because if so, that is freaking amazing. Hang on, I gotta try this. Warp? No way. That is amazing. Holy crap. I am so glad that I went through that door. Alright, well, let the grinding begin, officially, this time. For reals. Can't see my character.
Nice. Okay, so I just used all my souls to upgrade some of my black uh, black iron equipment. I keep wanting to say black knight equipment. So I'm going to use the black eye orb here. Try invading the world of the Firekeeper's Killer. Alright. Searching for world of the guilty. Invading world of the guilty as spirit of vengeance. Alright. Lautrec. That was his name. Golden knight son of a bitch. He's going down. 
I'm here for you! Invaded the world of Knight Lautrec the Guilty, and he has friends! There he is! There's no other enemies here, right? Good. Look how cool I look. <laughs> Bring it! I beat Ornstein and Smog. What are you to me? Oh boy, oh boy. I'm not about to take three on one fairly. Get into this narrow narrow corridor so I can take you on one at a time. Oh shit, he knows magic! Get away from it! I can't use Estus here? Well, that went well. <laughs> your phantom was vanquished. Return to your world. Well, hopefully I can use the orb again. Well, at least I don't, lo I, I don't lose souls or humanities, I notice, when I die. So let's try this again. Try invading the world of a firekeeper's killer again. I don't know why it takes so long to load the area if it's just an NPC. I'd understand if it was another player, but it's just another NPC. Here we go again. I notice I can use humanities here, so that's going to be my primary mode of healing. I probably should have healed the full before I tried this, but whatever. Alright, come on. Come at me, bro. Come at me, bro. Aggro and come at me, bro. Aggro and come at me, bro. There we go. Let's try this again. This time I'm going to go right around the corner so that he has to come up here. There we go. You don't even have that much health, you wuss. Oh, that's not him. Oh, shit. They're ganging up on me. Not good. Not good. Um, fall off. Pop humanity. There we go. Nope. I like those little weapons he has. I think I have one of them, but I didn't know you could dual wield them. Unless that's for Lotric only. I think it goes through my shield. I think his weapons go through my shields. My dogs are barking. I'm sorry about that. This is going to make for a very silly fight with them in the background. One down. <laughs> Plunging attack on your mage friend. Stop barking, puppies. Yeah, run, run, run. Play like a bitch? My dogs are barking. Stop it. There we go. I have six humanities. Holy God. You're done, Lautric. Next is your mage friend. Ow. Target destroyed. Souvenir of reprisal. Returning? No, I want to kill his mage friend. There we go. Alright. I got it. Firekeeper's soul, ring of favor and protection, and five humanities. That was so worth it. Holy crap. So I got the Firekeeper's soul back. I assume I have to bring it back to Firelink? What does the souvenir of, uh, whatever do? Hang on. I have a lot of souls. Holy crap. Maybe I should use some of these to upgrade my armor. That's probably what I'm going to do. Um, seriously, where's my souvenir? Did I pass it? Where is it? Um... It's not in my inventory. Where is it? Oh, there it is. It's a souvenir taken for subduing the guilty. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. Oh, it's his ear. <laughs> it's his ear. All right, I don't know what to do with it, but I'm going to head back to Firelink. All right, let's go ahead and do that. Um, wait, what is that? That little white light. You see that? Hang on. Hey, it's an item! 
Um, hmm. Let's see here. Helmet of favor, embraced armor of Is this Lautrec's corpse? Oh, man, I gotta check out his armor. Let's check this out. Um, it's actually, well, hang on, let me, let me see here. Uh, it's actually not that good compared to some other armors. Especially compared to my black iron set that I'm starting to upgrade. Hmm. Still, pretty, pretty awesome looking. Hang on, let me, uh, let me put on the full, full set and see what it looks like. There we go. Uh, where's the... Where is the... Yeah, there we are. Oh, oh man, look at us. Look at us. Woo! Alright, let's go back to Firelink. How freaking cool is that? Wow. Alright, let's go see if we can do something about uh, Miss Dead Firekeeper here. Return Firekeeper Soul. I knew it! I knew there'd be a way to do that. Return Firekeeper Soul to its owner. Thank you. She spoke! I'm Anastasia of Astora. Now I can continue my duty as a keeper. Happy to help. But... But I'm wearing your killer's armor. I only hope that my impure tongue does not offend. Oh, keep talking. Keep talking. So... Forgive me. <laughs> Don't worry about it's it. Impure. My tongue never intended for restoration. My dogs are still barking. Please, if you have any heart, Leave me. Why is she? Why is she so sad? I brought her back to life. Okay, so logically speaking, yeah, I can use the bonfire again. All right, so the good good news, I can use the bonfire here at Firelink again. Bad news, uh, I lost a Firekeeper soul, so my Estus flask can't be upgraded now. Um, hey, dude, I remember oh, you. So you made it out. Yeah, I, I made it out safely too. I have my pyromancy in the Great Swamp, so I can usually manage with a bit of care. Oh yeah, by the way, uh, I can share my spells with you. Oh really? You knack for it. All you need are the materials. I'll be pleased to help you. Why is he British? Uh, unless you find the magics unsavory. Uh, no, I don't find them unsavory. Yeah, wonderful. I'm sure that you know they'll be of some use, some assistance. Here, first take this. Hey, I got pyromancy. Flame from the great swamp. Now you're a fully fledged pyromancy. Well, that was easy. Well, let's get started right now. But of course, I have to purchase the spells from him. Um, holy crap, they cost a lot. Jeez. Well, I would use the. Hang on, iron flesh. Iron flesh, flesh boosts defense and resilience. Well, how long does it last? Intense sweating reduces flame damage. So some of these spells can actually be used for defense to improve tankiness. They don't necessarily have to be used for spells themselves. Pyromancy is the art of car. That's nice. So that's actually pretty cool. I'll have to uh, look into that. But for now, I'm going back to grind a little bit more. Back to An Orlando. Uh, I'm assuming Chamber of the Princess is where I want to go, right? How freaking cool is this? We can warp now. I'm, I'm still not over that. That's so goddamn cool. Yep, this is where I want to be. Alright, back to the grinding. Okay, now I've got to experiment with some of these warps. Like, Stone Dragon, what is that? Let's find out. Oh, it's back here at the, uh, the Dragon Covenant guy. Well, I found out I can chop your tail off. So guess what we're gonna do? Swing! Yeah! Dragon Great Sword! Sorry, bro. But I like my loot. 
Oh my god, that attack power. But I need 50 strength to wield it. Let's see what it looks like. Hang on, where'd it go? Where'd it go? Um, it's probably up a little bit. Yep, yep, I passed it. Hang on, there it is. Alright, it looks like that. It looks like a big, rusty turd. And I can't even run with it. Well, whatever. Just thought I'd throw that in there. Alright, time to upgrade the claymore. One. Uh, I can keep upgrading it, right? Uh, yeah, there it is. Two, three, four, five. There we go. Claymore is now plus ten, people. I wonder what I could do to it now. Absolutely nothing. Alright, that's as strong as it can get for now. Nice. There you are! Bring it! I still can't block that. Okay, I still can't block that. <laughs> uh, what was I thinking? There's no way I can take him on yet. Um, well, might as well give it a try. Where's my longbow? Here we are. <laughs> that was horrible. Here we go. That didn't hit him. Alright, alright, aim up. There we go. How do I get out of this stupid aiming mode? There we go. Hey, dragon! Hey, dragon! You remember me? Because I remember you! I'm gonna kick your ass for killing me all those times. Dodge your fire. What are you gonna do about it? Man, the Claymore does a lot of damage now. Okay, that's what he's gonna do about it. He can still one shot me despite the gold end equipment. <laughs> Why can't I make the dragon spawn again? I've run back and forth across these battlements like five times, and he has not appeared. I mean, did I kick his ass so much that he's just gone permanently now? You know, funny, the last time I thought that, he swooped down and killed me. So I'm not going to believe that for a second. I'm going to keep trying. Hey, Sunbro's here. Mm. Uh, oh, hello there. Forgive me. I was just pondering about my poor fortune. What? I did not find my own son, not in Anor Londo, nor in Twilight Blight Town. Where else might my son be? Your son? Lost Isaac, or the tomb of the Grave Lord? But I cannot give up. I became undead to pursue this. But when I peer at the sun up above, it occurs to me, what if I am seen as a laughing stock, as a blind fool without reason? That's pretty deep for an NPC, well, dude. I suppose they wouldn't be far off. <laughs> I get it, he made a sun pun. <laughs> Hello there. I will stay behind to gaze at the sun. The sun is a wondrous body, like a magnificent father. If only I could be so grossly incandescent. Uh-huh. Cool. Well, have fun with that, dude. I'm gonna go do normal things. Okay, so here's the deal. I'm back at the, uh... The Giant Smith dude to buy some Twinkling Titanite, and I can upgrade my Claymore Plus 10 to either a Lightning Claymore, which I would very much like to do, but I'd like some other opinions on it, or the Greatsword of Artorius with the Soul of Sif, but it looks like, if that was the case, I would need to uh, upgrade a lot of the stat requirements. Like, you, know, you see where it says required parameters? I would need to upgrade my dexterity to 18, which I have. 
but I don't think I have 18 faith or anything like that. And I don't even see the benefit of it because it reduces my attack. Unless it can be, it has some other, like, better purpose to it. So I'd like some other opinions on it before I even deal, before I even think about tinkering with this thing. For now, I'm just going to keep upgrading my black iron armor. Uh, so yeah, just leave some comments below and tell me what I should do with it. Alright, you know what time it is? It's time to go ahead and set all the souls that I've collected to my item box and use them all because I don't feel like grinding anymore. So, um, of course, not the boss souls or anything like that, but I'm talking like the nameless soldier souls, the lost souls, and all that jazz. Go ahead and set all these. Alright, let's go ahead and get this on. Okay, these souls are worth 10,000. Holy crap, I need to stop for a second. I know you can. I know you are. Okay, let's go ahead and buy quite a few of these. Um, yeah, let's stop at that. Reinforce armor. Alright, black iron set. Bring that up. Bring that up. Bring this up. I'm going to bring them up until it costs plus uh, two Twinkling Titanites to make them again. Alright. So, actually, I want to reinforce my... Do I want to reinforce this? It takes two for that, too? Man. Um, hmm. Hmm. I don't know. For now, I'm just going to keep upgrading my armor. You know what? Screw it. I'm impatient. I'm using these last two. Alright. That's the end of my soul items, aside from the boss souls, which I'm not going to burn. I'm not that dumb. Alright, um... Oh yeah, I don't have any Twinkling Titanite. Oops. Let's go ahead and buy four of them. And that way we can upgrade two more times. Nice. Oh man, I am rocking defense now. Alright guys, I stayed up until about 10 or 11 last night grinding. I grinded for a full, I would say, 4 hours maybe? Um, if it's any indication, there's 17 Titanite chunks, 17 Twinkling Titanite, because I went to the Stone Dragon area and grinded those clams out when I got done killing these night, night people. Um... So yeah, this is where we're at right now. Um, I, In total, I upgraded the Claymore to plus 10. As you're about to see, all my black, black iron armor is about to be plus 5. And I also upgraded my Halberd into a Lightning Halberd and upgraded that as far as I could because it has a much higher attack power than my Lightning Spear. So, I got that going for me. I think I, I might have overdid it a little bit because... Uh, I mean, that, that's a lot of stuff to be upgraded. Also, as you'll notice, um, I have taken a great liking to the Black Knight Greatsword because the amount of damage it can dish out when you... I mean, even just two-handing it or one-handing it, that, that kind of damage cannot be denied. I mean, I do like 500 damage or so with uh, two-handed attacks and 200 or so with one-handed and that kind of power just can't be denied, so I think that's what I'm going to be using for now until I upgrade. I know what to upgrade the Claymore into. But that's about it, guys. Um, just the rest of the video is going to show me upgrading, I believe it's the 
Halberd? No, it's the Black Knight Greatsword. I upgraded that into plus four. Oh, excuse me. So that's about it, guys. Uh, leave a comment below if you want to uh, recommend what I should turn the Claymore into. If not, um, honestly, not sure where to go with this playthrough at this point. Um, I might go head back and check out those golden doors that should not be there anymore since I beat Ornstein Smog. But until then, have a good day, guys, and take care.